a larger bill and fewer services. The reality for people in Prattsville starting this month. On Saturday, the town stopped offering trash collection as part of everybody's water bill while raising rates on water users. Neil Zerang joining us now live from Grant County with more on this. Neil, there, there's some cause and effect here, but certainly to a lot of folks, I'm sure they say this math just doesn't add up to them. Bob, there is more than one reason for the water rates going up, and the same can be said for disconnecting those trash services from the water department bill. It comes with baggage answering why water rates went up and trash services were disconnected in Prattsville. Bernice Evans first suggested in April receiving a letter from the city explaining how to pick a private option by June or let the trash pile up. And I called Joe Ray and asked him if he would continue to be my trash pickup. Ray says most of his previous customers have signed back on. Some have yet to, even though he's offering the same price. It's helping the city out by us doing it now instead of them having to do it, saving them time and money. A lot of people wondering why, but uh, everything's expensive nowadays. The town isn't very big, with around 500 water customers, they say, and the water department found themselves handling the trash collector's secretarial duties for pay and at times customer service for trash collection. As a resource and cost-cutting measure, they offloaded that responsibility to the private market. We don't hear about the services being taken away a whole lot, but it's obviously something that maybe has to be done depending on the circumstances. According to the Arkansas Municipal League, water rate increases are something many towns have on their horizon if they haven't seen it already. It's because in 2021, an Arkansas law required water department rate studies every five years. In Prattsville, the new water rate will be recommended in 2025. The town's mayor said they had not increased the rate in a decade, and he wanted to get partially ahead of it. This is fairly common. So that would make sense that they would have to go up in their water rates and doing it, in, doing it incrementally makes a ton of sense. But further increases is something Evans wishes she could just throw away. It'd be rough for it to continue to go up. I did get to sit down with the mayor of Prattsville just a little bit too soon to this report to include it in the story. He answered a couple of my questions saying that people are not allowed to burn their trash on their property here inside Prattsville, that there also are penalties for people who just leave their trash standing. And just another note, definitely the weather's moving in here into South Arkansas, so stay safe, everyone. Reporting live in Prattsville, Niels Rang, KRK4 News. All right.